Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you Dell G2724D best settings. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. In this case, you might be wondering what are the best settings here for your uh, Dell G2724D. In this case, there are a few things you might want to change here. So first is you might want to update the native resolution. So make sure your monitor is set to its native resolution. This ensures the best clarity and detail for your image and text. Next is you want to check your refresh rate here. Ensure that your graphics card supports the appropriate refresh rate for your monitor. This will enhance the smoothness of motion in games and videos. Also, check your brightness. Set the brightness between 75 to 80. This level provides a good balance between visibility and comfort, especially in well-lit environments. Now also, adjust the contrast between 75 and 80 as well. This enhances the distinction between dark and light areas, giving you your images more depth. Now, what about preset mode here? Choose custom color. This allows you to fine-tune the display settings to your liking rather than relying on standard presets. Also, RGB settings. Set the RGB channels to 98, 95, and 100. These values help achieve vibrant colors and ensure accurate color production. Now, for sharpness, you might want to adjust this to 50. So, in this case, this provides clear images without making them look artificially harsh. Now, for response time, set this to fast or super fast, depending on your preference. A faster response time reduces motion blur, which is specifically beneficial for gaming. Now, for adaptive sync, make sure to adapt, uh, in this case, enable the adaptive sync option. This feature helps reduce screen tearing and provides a smoother gaming experience. Now, for dark stabilizer, set this to 0 to 2. This settings enhances visibility in dark scenes without losing detail in lighter areas. Now, for input, input, input source, use the HDMI input for connecting your device. This ensures optimal signal quality. Now, for dynamic contrast, turn this off. Disabling dynamic contrast helps the brightness consistent across all content. Now, for smart HDR, also turn smart HDR off. This can help maintain a natural look without exaggerated colors. And that's about it. So, hopefully this video was able to help you like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.